Hi everyone. Today we are going to start chapter number 5 mass. Book 3A, worksheet number 1, mass in kilogram and gram. So first we have to study that what is mass, what is kilogram and what is gram. So here are some of the definitions at the back side of the book. Mass, the amount of matter in an object. Kilogram, a unit of measure of mass where 1 kg is equal to 1000 gram. Simply it means that kilogram is the heavier unit of mass and gram is the smaller unit of mass. Now let's start the worksheet. First we have to write the name, class and date. Read the scale and write the mass of the items. Number 1 is 250 and then 300, 350, 400, 450. So the gap between each line is 50. So after 250 we have 300. So the gram mass of corn is 300 gram. Here we have again with the same mass 50 50 difference. So the mass is after 750 we have 800. Here we have to write the mass separately. 1 kg complete 1 kg and again we have after 1 we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 700 gram because 1 kg is equals to 1000 gram. So it means the gap between is 100, 100, 100. Next is it is 3 kg complete 3 kg and the gram is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 600 gram. Page number 144, here the kilogram is 2, 2 kilogram and the gram is 900. Again, the kilogram is 3 and simple gram is 100. Read the scale and write the mass of the item. Now here is the difference of the number between is 1, 2, 3, 4, 400 gram. Here is the difference between 500, 6, 7, 8, 9, 900 gram. Here is the difference 1 kg, 300 gram. Here is the difference 1500, complete 1 kg and 5 plus 1 is 600 gram. Page number 145, read and write the mass of items. Again, we have to read and write the mass. 2 kg, 100 gram. 2 kg, 600 gram. 3 kg, 400 gram. 4 kg, 800 gram. Here we have 8 kg means 8000 gram. 4 kg, 4000. 3000 gram, 3 kg. 9,000 gram, 9 kg. Page number 147. Here we have to write the grams and kilograms separately. So 1 kg is 1,000 gram and 600. 1,000 plus 600 is 1,600. 3 kg, 3,430. 3,000 plus 430 is 3,430. 8,505. We are going to write this separately. 8,000 gram is 8 kg 8 kilogram 8 kilogram and 505 separate 4 kilogram number 6 is write each child's mass in gram here we have 5030 so when we are going to add this the answer is 5030 9 kg means 900 gram and 101 is gram 9101 gram here we have to write Miss Ten arrange some books into five piles. The mass of each pile of book is shown. Help Miss Ten record their mass in kilogram and gram. Here is the mass given. 2 kg 399 gram 1 kg 880 gram 3 kg 50 gram 1 kg 302 gram 1 kilogram 100 gram page number 149 write the name class and date solving what problem an empty pail with 
360 gram city fills it with sand the total mass of the pail and the sand is 3320 gram what is the mass of the sand give your answer in kilogram and gram so first we have to write the larger amount 3320 and the smaller amount empty pail 360 now we are going to subtract this 360 the amount of empty pail from the total number 3320 minus 360 is 2960 3320 360 0 and 0 we are going to take the borrow 2 1 become 12 12 minus 6 is 6 12 minus 3 is 9 and 2 same as it is so the answer is 2960 now we have to write the answer in kilogram and gram so 2000 means 2 kg and 960 is separately 960 gram page number 150 a container is filled with 280 grams of sugar the empty container weight 300 what is the total mass of sugar and the container so we have to add both the numbers 2800 plus 300 so the answer is 3100 the total mass of sugar and container is 3100 gram or separately 3 kg 100 gram mrs lim has 720 gram of salt she packed the salt equally into nine packs what is the mass of salt in each packet simply 720 divided by 9 720 divided by 9, 9 is 72, 0 goes here, so it becomes 80. It means she packed 80 packets of salt. It means that the, that the mass of salt in each pack is. Question number 4 is the mass of a sack of rice is 4500 gram and the mass of the chicken is 1400 gram. Number A, how much heavier is the sack of rice than the chicken? What is the total mass of the sack of rice and the chicken? Give your answers in kilogram and gram. So let's see here we have the sack of rice 4500. Here we have chicken. Now 4500 minus 1400. Simply subtract 4500 with 1400. So the answer is 3100. It means the sack of rice is 3100 heavier. Now 1400 this amount chicken and 4500 rice because we have to find the total mass now add both the numbers 1400 4500 add the numbers 9 5900 5900 now we have to convert this into gram and kilogram 5 kilo 900 gram so the answer is 5 9 page number 152 question number 5 Ahmed's mass is 32 kg the total mass of Ahmed and his cat is 37 kg what does the mass of Ahmed's cat how much heavier is Ahmed than his cat mass of Ahmed 32 kg mass of his cat 32 minus 37 5 kg 32 minus 5 is 27 the mass of Ahmed's cat is 5 kg Ahmed is 27 kg heavier than cat number 6 there are 4 tins of paint in a box the mass of each tin is 2 kg the mass of the empty box is 1100 gram what is the mass of the box with the tins of paint give your answer in kilograms so here first we have to multiply the tens with the kgs two four is the eight so the total mass of 10 of paint is 8 kg now we have to convert this 8 kg into grams 8 kilograms into grams so 8 means 8000 8000 plus 1100 gram now we have to add 8000 with 1100 
zero zero one and nine so the total gram is nine hundred and eleven now we have to convert this nine hundred and eleven into gram and kilogram nine thousand means nine and hundred same as it is so the total mass of the box and the tens of paint is nine kilogram and hundred gram number seven the total mass of two loaves of bread and five buns is 650 gram the two loaves of bread weight 400 gram what is the mass of each bun simply 650 minus 400 650 minus 400 so the answer is 250 the bun weight 250 gram altogether now we have to divide this 250 with 5 because we have 5 buns 250 minus 5 is 50 so each bun has a mass of 50 gram number 8 the mass of the packet of sugar is 500 gram. The mass of sack of rice is 2500 gram. What is the total mass of 6 packets of sugar and a sack of rice? So we simply multiply 6 with the packet of sugar mass. 6 multiplied by 500. So the answer is 3000. The, pack, uh, the 6 packets of sugar have a mass of 3000 gram. 3000 plus 2500 sack of rice so the answer is 5500 the total mass of sugar and the sack of rice is 5500 gram page number 154 write the date here we have mind workout who is lighter zini or bala so here we can see that zini is having the weight with 1 kg and bala is having the weight with 2 kg so it means that bala is lighter because 2 kg of weight is placed separate review 5 page number 155 write your name class and date here we have 500 then 50 and then 600 then 650 the gap between the numbers is 50 now here we have 0 1 2 3 so here we have 300 gram now here we have complete 4 kilogram and after 4 we have 2, 4, 6, 8. So here we have 800 gram. Now here we have complete 1 kg and here after 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 800 gram. Page number 156, here we simply have to convert this kilograms into grams. Same as it is, write in kilogram and gram. Here we have the numbers in gram. We have to convert this into kgs and gs, kilograms and grams. The first number is simply into kilogram and the remaining are gram. Here we have the matching. Now here we have to write the true and false. The chair is heavier than the flower pot. Here is the weight of chair and here is the weight of flower pot. 200 gram. Simply convert this. So it is true. The mass of the table is equal to 5 kg and 5 grams. No, it is not equal. False. Because it is 500 gram, not 5 gram. If Farhan can lift object up to 2005 gram, he can carry the flower pot, yes, because it is 2000 kg. What is the total mass of the table and the chair? So, the total mass of table and chair, table and chair, 8480 gram. How much lighter is the flower pot than the chair? Simply subtract the chair and the flower pot, so the answer is 980 gram. Here we have the mass of a bag of carrot is 650 gram. The mass of the bag of tomato is 800 gram. What is the total mass of bag of carrot and the bag of tomatoes? Give your answers in kilograms and grams. 650, 800. Simply add the numbers 1450. So the total mass of the bag of carrot and the bag of tomato is 1 kg 450 grams. Here we have three similar packets of salt weight 420 kg. A bag of salt is 400 grams heavier than the packet of salt. What is the mass of one packet of salt? What is the mass of 
bag of sugar so here we simply have to divide 420 with 3 so the answer is 140 it means one packet of salt has a mass of 140 gram now 400 plus 140 400 is the sugar and 140 is the salt 400 plus 140 is 540 the bag of sugar has a mass of 540 gram city's mass is 35 kg the total mass of city and her mother is 97 kg find the difference in mass between cities and her mother 97 minus 35 is 62 97 35 city's mass uh, mother's mass is 62 kg now 62 minus 35 because we have to find the difference 62 minus 35 is 27 so the difference between mother and city is 27 kg last word problem of chapter number 5 mr. 10 bought five similar mangoes and a watermelon the mass of each mango is 600 gram the mass of watermelon is was 2300 what was the total mass of the mango and the watermelon? Give your answers in kilograms and grams. Simple 5 multiplied by 600. So the answer is 3000. Now 2300 plus 3000 is 5300. So the total mass of the mangoes and the watermelon is 5 kg 300 grams.